It's been nearly six months since someone gunned down William Toll of Gridley. His family is still waiting for answers. New this morning, Action News Now reporter Defet Serrato took their questions to police to see if they have any leads. Toll was just 37 years old when he was killed. Family says he was kind and humorous and he left this earth way too early. November 22nd, 2020, around 6.30 p.m., that's when someone opened fire on William Toll near Washington and Laurel in Gridley. That killer still on the loose. We want somebody who, who knows what they're doing. We don't want to be a practice run. Rhonda Toll is pleading for help in hopes of figuring out who killed her son, William. My fiancé was shot down right here. The family thinks he was walking to town to grab a bite to eat. Toll was shot multiple times right next to these storage units. You can see one of the bullet holes covered up, but if you look a little bit closer, more bullet holes in other units. That's crazy to think that somebody that you are with every day, something so horrible could happen to them and you have no clue. Tears streaming down their faces. Loved ones say they have questions for Gridley police. I took those questions to police. How come they didn't know what kind of vehicle it was? The video I viewed showed a dark sedan, but it was hard to tell which, for, as a matter of fact, what make and model. There were suspicions of potentially what kind of vehicle, but it was nothing ever positive. The family also wondering about the investigation itself. They didn't have forensic come down here and do anything. Kiwi says they did collect evidence. The problem is waiting for the DOJ to process it. They get a lot of evidence from several agencies so we are too in line with everybody else as far as the priority goes and based on this home surveillance video where you can hear what sounds like gunfire and see some sort of activity in the upper left corner kiwi says he believes two people were involved very family oriented while the investigation goes on family will continue to visit tolls memorial hoping justice is served our pain will go on forever it, it'll never stop the family also says they do not disrespect the Gridley Police Department. A memorial will be held for toll on his birthday where he was shot next Tuesday. Back to you. All right, thank you, Defet. Now, police say they call the DOJ every week to see where it stands on processing the evidence that was sent.